I'm in your walls. I'm in your walls. I'm in your walls. Bruh. Cup with a P, YouTube. YouTube.com. Cup. Yeah, demonetize me now, buddy. Whoever's from YouTube.com overseeing that this video gets monetized, okay? I know you're gonna watch the first 15 seconds. You're gonna go, yeah, this is probably a good video. Guess what, buddy? I'm about to say the worst, most diabolical, offensive, misogynist things throughout the rest of this video. So you better lock in for an absolute super dummy mega heater. Because if you don't, you're gonna miss the funniest joke of the lifetime. Yeah, you're gonna demonetize it, but you're gonna laugh all the way to the bank. You wish, buddy. Edging streak's over. The Redemption Tour is making its laps around college football. It's the ECU Pirates season. If you miss the season opener, I'm sorry that you don't have a father figure in your life. But we landed on the ECU Purple Pirates. Now, legend Chris Johnson was a pirate, so that's our team captain. We've got an awesome halfback. We lost our very first game, but we completed our challenge wheel, so I saved our franchise quarterback. That's Lamar Jackson. Franchise QB, whatever. You know what I mean? Dynasty QB. We prestige Jonah Monheim. We've built up a decent offensive line. Still rocking a silver tight end. We got Ocho Cinco and Travis Hunter at wide receivers. Defensively, it's ugly. Virtually no linebackers, no corners other than Will Johnson, but the D-line looks pretty good, and we've got two really good safeties. We're one and one on the season, and for the regular season only, I'll be playing two games per episode. Gentlemen, I won't waste your time. Let's get this first spin on Wheel of Cut. T cut, YouTube, you little cucks. Three, I low-key would take that. Ooh. Maybe even better. Team wheel 84, 85. We got the Giga team wheel here. We could take any player from the team this lands on. 84 to 85 overall. It's an H team. It's a G team. Georgia Tech, Yellow Jackets. Yeah, something tells me they're not gonna have an 84, 85. In the case they don't, we gotta go down to the next tier, but I don't know my Georgia Tech lore, I'll be honest. Although I am a good guesser. They have no 84, 85s. How about 82, 83s, Georgia Tech? They've got a left end and a punter. Oh, they have a tight end. Oh, I missed the days when I had a tight end. I'm all blown out now. What? All right, he's, dude, he's a big boy. Six foot six, 75 speed, rolling goad. Yeah, I mean, he's not a speed demon. It's not Mark Andrews of the past, but it's a usable starting tight end who's a hell of a lot better than the silver we've got in there. Gervais Johnson, welcome to the bench. I really don't mind starting out like that at all. It's not a monster wheel spin, but we'll do what we can. Our next one. Ooh! Big Ten jackpot is so much better now, too, because the Big Ten is full of so many teams now. The first guy that came to mind was Quinchon Judkins, but I've got CJ2K, so it's probably not gonna be him unless we moved into wide receiver. Although I'm sure that there are a ton of high-quality Big Ten options. Let's start with 88 to 89. So there's Abdul Carter, who low-key would be very nice. I have no linebackers right now. There's Quinchon Judkins, who wouldn't do a lot for me, and there's Will Johnson, who we already have on this team. There's Desmond Howard. I honestly think Abdul Carter would be super nasty here. Abdul Carter is crazy fast. I might just put him at my user. 84 speed, 84 excel, 6 foot 3 power rusher. He's such a good edge rusher though, it's kind of wasted as a user, but maybe we can get a user linebacker on this next spin and he can play a true outside linebacker. But Abdul Carter is a no-brainer there. We pick up a Penn State stud, a super good outside linebacker, and again, an 88 overall. That's a huge spin right there. Abdul Carter added to the lineup our third and final wheel spin. Looks like it might be 84, 85 again. No. Got a mini game. So I'm gonna have a choice here. I can definitely pick up a user middle linebacker. Now we just gotta go do a defense mini game. We get 25K per tier. Bronze is 25K, silver is 50, gold is 75. It's a random team and I get to take on James Madison, which is super good, except I'm Southern Mississippi. So any of these mini games, oh, if I was a cheeser, bro, if I really was a cheeser, I'd go trench battle. It's the easiest gold of all time. Actually, let's make it random. Hey Siri, can you give me a random number one through eight? Oh shit, it actually is trench battle. She didn't, um, she didn't audibly say it. I put her on mute. I just cannot stand taking orders from a woman. But it's trench battle long haul, so I'm not cheesing it. I don't know who Baker is, but let's hope you can cook, buddy. All right, good start. Another good start. Gotta get off it. Gotta get off it. We're getting all the multipliers. We're staying on our feet. Oh, I didn't get that one. That's the only multiplier I didn't get. But we got bronze already. Dude, it makes it makes it feel like I'm a Pittsburgh Steeler. These look exactly like Steelers unis to me. Southern Miss, Golden Eagles. Yo, Baker's a dog. This guy's a beast. I mean, granted, it's James Madison O-lineman. I wonder if this was against like Georgia. Would this just be the hardest drill of all time? All right, I got off of that. Quick move off of that one. 
Oh, get shit on. And I still got the multiplier. It's a big time gold, baby. I'm not gonna pretend like it was hard, but it is a gold that gives me 75,000 coins to spend on one player. And the market is a lot different than it used to be. What kind of overall can we get? Can we get an 86 for 75K? That is a hard no. We're definitely gonna get an 85 though. There's Eric Kendricks, who I really do not like Eric Kendricks. Is Mondin as good as he is in quick play? This dude is so fast in quick play. 6'3", 83 speed, 83 excel. That's really, really good. I'm taking Mondin Jr., the Georgia middle line. Linebacker. He's 60,000 coins. It's a good thing we got gold. We just landed ourselves a brand new user in a linebacker. This was an all like linebacker episode. I got a tight end too, but Abdul Carter and Mondin, massive upgrades to our linebacker core. All right, we're rocking a 79 overall now. Defense looks a lot better and we could throw an ability or two on Abdul Carter. How much are you going to pass rush? I'm going to give him grip breaker. Lateral sheds on run plays. I'm not trying to get gashed on the edge. Offense still needs a lot of work to be done. I need two more wide receivers, a fullback, a right guard, a right tackle and a better tight end. I am not too big on him. 79 overall is so much better than we were using before. This is a very winnable game no matter who we face. So you got to get the challenge wheel, baby. Challenge wheel has been very good to us. It saved us Lamar. Got us a huge pack last time. And it's 100 plus rushing yards. Definitely have not completed this in the last two games. So hopefully we can turn something around here. CJ2K. Oh, I thought that was my team. CJ2K, Eric Kendricks. Is that Mike Evans? Our top three looks so good. He's got an 83 overall. He's Eastern Michigan. We're Eastern Carolina with a 79. Gonna try out some new formations for ECU today. Motion halfback cross. Really interesting play. But CJ2K. There's no way. Yo, that play's kind of nasty. Big tackle out of his safety. Yo, I'm saving that one. Gun slot left weak. What else is in this playbook? Let's stay in this formation. First and 10. Let's go get those rushing yards. We need 100. That's zero. Casual first down while on the phone. I'm built like that. First and goal, CJ2K. Hey, give me those yards. We got about 13 of 100 right now. It's feeling like a go for two kind of day. You know what I'm saying? Lamar? Lamar, go be Lamar. Go be Lamar! Shit! Don't house it. Oh! Oh! And that's it! Dude, what did I just watch? Okay, okay, I know that there's a rule that says an offensive lineman can't advance the ball. That was a halfback. That was Chris Johnson, right? Maybe it's not a go for two days. Camera's all messed up. I don't know what's going on here, but he goes for the jet sweep. Bottled up by JPJ. Second and 13. Good start on defense. There's a play action. We've got bodies on. You can't throw this. You cannot. Third and 13. I'm blitzing with McNeil Warren. I've got a lane. I don't have shit! You're a silver. Will Johnson, you gotta use those wheels, buddy. He's gonna try and juke inside. Okay. Ormond, you are so fucking useless. It's insane how slow these silvers are. Mike Evans just did the slowest spin of all time and Ormont could not catch up to him. All right, best case scenario here, we score, get the two point and get this back to 14 to seven. Let's try and get those rushing yards too. We need a hundred plus rushing yards. Edge? No, cut it back up. Don't forget I have Lamar, fellas. Lamar can get rushing yards too. He is up with Bosa. Hello? Easy slide with Lamar. I might be able to get this off. Two, one. Get the snap off. Oh my God, what a shot. Bringing out speed option is so risky, but it's just so, so good. Beautiful pitch. Get inside of him. Ooh, nice broken tackle. All right, we got a read option here. Third and seven. Let's see if he bites. Oh, yikes. I think he did bite. Fourth and nine. Big play. Nobody blocked that guy on the edge. Lamar. Lamar! You like that! I like that! What a play! I was on fourth and nine. First and ten, I'm going back to the speed option. I'm gonna get this off quick. It's a bad pitch. I should have kept it though. And I'm losing rushing yards doing that. Second and 15, just going classic inside zone here before the two minute warning. I got Ocho Cinco in the seam. I got Goad on this kind of delay. Ooh, beautiful route. That route is sick. Oh, that, he thought for sure that was a corner route. He overplayed it so bad. It's a nice play, but I'm really not on pace for my rushing yards. Most important thing's the touchdown. Oh, quite the blitz. Get it off to CJ2K. That is what Lamar is so good at. He always makes those throws on the run. And you know what? I'll just take my PAT here. Keep it simple. I hate you, Ormont. You are the bane of my existence. Wow, that's a nasty route. First and 10. He does not have that. 
He has that, though. And look who it is. Ormont. He kind of made that tackle, though. Who's on who here? Shit. Shit. Oh, he gets that off, but I have so many bodies on this. Fuck me running. Good move. Oh, I could have easily done something there. First and goal, 60 seconds. I expect a run. No. He's gonna step up with Will Howard! Oh, he almost got leveled! And I don't know where he was throwing. Second and goal. I'm okay with a run. I'll be able to stop him. No run. Bodies, 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 fumble! Does he chew the clock or do I save my timeout? I don't think he's chewing the clock. Big play. Oh, sweep out to the right. Nice play. He gave me a lot of time to score, though, in two timeouts. So we just get at least a field goal up. We take the lead. I know I can stop him on defense. Stop it. You can do that? Dude, I always forget that if he picks that ball up, this is not a punt. He gets the ball. I hate that shit. Looking for CJ2K, best case scenario here. Wait a minute. Oh my god, he just left so much room for Ocho Cinco. The spin! Let's go! Timeout, Purple Pirates. That was a huge mistake by him. He's on Bosa inside release. I can't throw that. And just take this out of bounds. Delayed blitz. Ocho Cinco. Ocho Cinco! Shh. Suck me dry. Ah! Oh, that was so open! I gotta get points. If we gotta check it down, we gotta check it down. Beautiful. This is really good. It's a lot of rushing yards and it's out of bounds with one second. Sketchy. Beautiful. Eh? Beautiful. Pirates take the lead with absolutely no time left on the clock. And I tacked on about 20 rushing yards. The problem is he's got the ball. I don't expect him to run it. Well, what do you fucking know? Although, honestly, that, that cut saved that. I'm over there with Mondin. He's forced to cut it up the middle. Jet sweeps are good. Quick throw to his halfback. And we're just gonna get hit! Mondin! We held him up to get hammered! You're not quitting. You are not. Game! No! That is the perfect scenario for a fumble. He was held at the ankles and Mondin had a clear lane. I knew Mondin was the right choice. Let's go. Now this is a unique scenario because he kind of robbed my ability to complete the challenge wheel. So rather than spin the rage quit wheel, I'm just gonna take one pack for the challenge wheel because honestly, one really good pack is usually better than the challenge wheel. So I think we should get the better of the two scenarios. And I'm gonna go right back to the ultimate alumni premium pack. This pack is so good. But frankly, it's kind of dog shit in general. Ooh, what did we just get? So yeah, give me that spicy ass animation for an 83. It's really good for Wheel of Cut, but that's an aggressive animation for him. 75 center is not going to help me. 82 right guard is huge. Renato Brown and our final player, 77 left end. Now I can move my center to right tackle. Here's Ormont. We can finally get Ormont fully out of this lineup, get Donovan McMillan in. We will never see Ormont again. I got no complaints. That's an awesome first game win. We moved to two and one. We're missing a middle linebacker. We're missing two corners, which is very scary. But defense. Defense looks really, really good. I can spend some time on offense and picking up corners and we'll be in a good spot. And let's move into this next game, gentlemen. We got three wheel spins. We're looking for corners and maybe a season one top 12. Oh. Core elites 82 to 83. Just pick up any usable 83 overall corner. All right, Florida State. I said I'd get you guys back and I will. Fentrell Cypress. Slot corner, 82 speed, 82 excel. Stamir got 82 everything. It's a very standard core elite, but I need corners. A very standard upgrade for this first upgrade, but we definitely need corners. So we'll take it. Our second one, conference wheel. This is like one of my favorite spins. So let's go. One of any single player, but they must come from the, not the Mac. FBS would be weird, but it would work. Not the Conference USA. There's so many conferences in college football, I'm in Conference USA. Shit. Shit. Well, they got 84, 85s, and I've actually seen these guys before. I think I might have gotten this before, because I had Sean Brown on my team. It's not a bad opportunity to pick up another good wide receiver, though. Trayon Sibley out of Liberty. He's not impressive by any means. But you can't judge a book by its cover. We have three good wide receivers now. Ocho, Cinco, Sibley, and Travis Hunter. I'm not going to lie to you, buddy. You haven't been too kind to me. So if you want to clutch up right now, I wouldn't be mad about it. Come on. Come on. Pack a punch. 
Does that work for us right now? Ooh, I gotta think about this. It absolutely works for us. So pack a punch. I can take any player on the roster and get their best version possible. Remember when we got those Legends packs? I have a few good options here. I could go Laramie Tunzel. I could get his full 87. Jadevian Clowney and get his full 87. Clowney's full legend, South Carolina Gamecock. But the thing is, I've already got James Pierce Jr. The gas mask man with CJ2K. We're gonna have some crazy stretch runs and speed options. I'm going Laramie Tunzel. 82 Jadevian Clowney's already good. He's boosted to an 88 overall and I can give him an ability. Wear down. Successful blocks on pass plays add slight fatigue to the engaged defender. I feel like if I if that activated enough times, it would be so easy to scramble. Activated. Look at the abilities on offense, man. Strong grip, wear down, shifty. All right, gentlemen, this team couldn't be much more ready. We're an 82 overall with a beautiful top five. Will Johnson, Abdul Carter, Chris Johnson, Lamar Jackson, and Mondin Jr. Now two and one on the season. Of course, we've got a challenge wheel. And we got to go yard. 300 plus passing yards. In our very first game, we threw for 489. So I know we can do this. Top three. That is so good to see. Ocho Cinco, Ray Lewis Singleton. We're going to have the same overall for the first time. Will Johnson, Abdul, and CJ2K. He's Georgia. It's going to be 82 versus 82. No, Pistol Train. Remember Pistol Train? This is what killed us in the natty. It was this exact play. That exact play right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah! I don't even know who Mills is! Third and ten, he's five wide. Good little pass rush, boys. Whip route's open, but he's not gonna take it. The post is there, too, but he doesn't get it off! Damn, he really waited. He wanted everything. Mid blitz against five wide every time. You just gotta watch the whip route. Fourth and ten. Big play. There's a whip route on the right side, but he's gotta get all of it. Shit. All right, after a scary fourth down, guess what everybody does? They run the football. Just kidding. This is absolutely a pass. I smell corner outs. He's five wide. I'm on Mondin. The whip route's there. He takes it. Woo! Imagine we made a play on that ball. Whip route's there again. The dig is not. Throw the fucking dig. I dare you. Oh, that's open. That comeback is... Stevie Wonder, is that you? It's not a piano, buddy. It's actually an Xbox controller. It's gonna be a long day at the Matt Maher Ranch. I'm going straight to a P. Diddy party if I lose this game. Fourth and six. Come on, boys. Fourth and six. You did not just run read option. You know what? If you handed that off, too, you would have gotten that. And look at that. It's 82 overall Jadevian Clowney. We never needed the big boy. Just kidding. That's that. Dual Carter, I'm full of shit. He's cheating right side. To that bitch, give me head! Ocho Cinco! Ironically, he's not Ocho Cinco in this game because he's number 80. He's Ocho Z Zero? Do I look like I speak Spanish to you? One time I speak Spanish is when a Latina baddie is hitting me up in the bar. Hola. Como estas? Estoy bien, E2. Mi pene es más grande. Is that Riz or what? Second and two. Come on! CJ! 2K! End zone, ECU on top. Two point conversion, cause we're greedy, greedy bastards. And I think CJ2K is a free, free bird. Shit! That came off the non Laramie Tunzel side. All right, let's try a standard kickoff. I think we can do this and have good coverage. Yeah, like I've got Donovan McMillan there. There's Asante, beautiful. Here's Pistol Train. Let's just take the high safety in case this is the run that we expect it to be. Yep. I'm going on this silver, dude. I'm going on Mills. Handoff. Hey, Mills. A scary down for Georgia. And he goes gun wide. You're a psycho, dude. Can I shoot this? Can I shoot this? Your cock is so big. I'm, I, dude. Oh my God. Did you see how I shot that gap? You're, so, oh my God. First and 10. I got to stop running nickel. Cause I have this bum in here every play. Oh my goodness. Cypress. Who is Smith? Is that Devonta Smith? He looks huge. That was our Florida State corner, Cypress. He's got 82 speed, but 82 wasn't enough. Look at A. Can Lamar make that? Oh my God, Lamar, you're so good. That's the new tight end. Oh, shifty. Give me a block. Oh, you're so slow. 21 is a silver. Oh no, it's not. That's Trayon Sibley. Oh, you're just homeless. Oh, my bad. I guess you don't want to play college ball. Freeze Carolina. Hit the fucking portal, buddy. Pitch. Pitch of a lifetime. It's Clay Russell, the non-real BYU Cougar, soaking his way for eight yards. Second and two. Clay Russell masterclass. Up the middle. I own you. I own you. I own you. I own you. Clay Russell. Come on, Clay. Get your ass in that end zone. Get your Cougar soaking Joseph Smith loving Mormon ass in that end zone. Oh!
You just got raw dog by Clay Russell. That's insane. I don't even think he's legally allowed to do that. A big one. A big one. Lamar. Hee <laughs> hee XD. 14 to 7. I was thinking about chewing clock, scoring no time left, but I think I can stop my defense again. What do you got? What do you got? The voices in my head are screaming right now. They are screeching. They're speaking Spanish to us. I don't know what the hell they're saying. First and 10. Hey, por cabre de porqueras! I dare you to throw that shit. You're bagged! Donovan McMillan, suck his balls! Come on! What did I say? I said we could stop him again. All right, we need passing yards. Why is Clay Russell still in? Can you get injured? Clay Russell is still in. Ta da, bitch. Give me head. Just get the first. Beautiful. Oh my god, he's hurt. I guess you can get hurt. I can't believe that. I had no idea. Second and 12, there's gonna be a seam for Ocho Cinco, and he's not gonna be able to use her it. I own you. They don't pay me the big bucks for no reason. Clay Russell's hot. That's hilarious. This is real life, ladies and gentlemen. Lamar gonna get around the edge. Oh, that's gotta be painful. That's gotta be painful to watch. Stop it, Lamar. Out of bounds. Passing yards don't matter so much now. Now it's about taking a two-possession lead. This, this uh, formation is pretty damn good. First and goal. Can I get around the right side? I can't. Oh, you make this throw? Timeout, Georgia. I'm taking it. Is that in? Okay, 17 to seven, healthy lead. A good squib kick here will take us into halftime. I think it's his ball at half. Yeah, cause he has to field this. He doesn't have to, he could fair catch that. Just play safe. 17 to seven, brand new news to me, you can get injured. Yeah, no, he's 100% out. Cause that was CJ2K previously. Oh no, he's right there. He's so fatigued, did you see that? His wear and tear is cooked. In online, you can have this happen. His speed is down to 69. I can't believe that. Yeah, it's gonna be Clay Russell the rest of the game. It's so good that we have a 10 point lead. All right, we just had to get out of this game alive. I gotta go chew clock. And obviously we just gotta use our wide receivers. I don't think he's guarding out routes. He's not. Well, I mean, sort of. CJ Tuke's back in, but he's got negative speed right now. Just stay clean in this pocket, stay smart. <laughs> he thinks my eyes are downfield. Trust me, buddy. I was paying attention. All right, here's what we do. Travis Hunter and Goad. Simple read. Three-man rush. Patience. Oh, I dare you to get to that ball. Good luck, buddy. First and 10, Travis Hunter, absolute laser beam inbound. Just kidding. That's bag. So glad I didn't. Ready for the stop and pop? Oh, he switched off. Yeah, that is the only way that you, you successfully stopped me there. Look at CJ 2K out of the backfield. This could be a nasty, nasty route. Oh my God, it is. What a dog, dude. Hangs on. He's got no stats. He should be in the fucking ECU right now. Ocho Cinco's open. No, but Goat is. No, nobody's open. Okay, infinite time. Infinite time. Good blocks, gentlemen. That D-tackle can't keep up with Lamar. Wait a minute. <laughs> patience, 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 patience. I can playmaker. Blocks are so good. Okay, he's finally off his block. I should I should make something out of that. Lamar is very fatigued. And he's conceded the game. That was pretty lame, Rage Quit, but yeah, I understand. The back-to-back -back Rage Quit episode pushes us to three and one. Same boat as last time. I don't know that we got 300 plus passing yards, but he took away our ability to. So we're gonna get one more pack. I'm gonna hammer another Ultimate Alumni Premium pack. Maybe we'll get lucky. First player, 75 right tackle. It's actually an upgrade to this team. Dylan Carpenter, outs that's a big boy. It has to be, because you don't get this animation otherwise. No! Oh my God, first Will Johnson, Jadeveon Clowney's bum little brother, and we get Lamar again. Dude, it's a monster pull too. Although Dylan Carpenter is nice and a true right tackle is nice too, because that's a, a minor upgrade. Great games. And our MLB too gets an upgrade now because we get to put uh, Dylan Carpenter in here. So that's really, really good. So who is this dude Mills? Okay, Chris Mills. This is our biggest liability on defense, Chris Mills. Definitely got to do something about that, but dude. Unlucky about Lamar, but two big wins, two rage quits, we're three and one, we're two wins away from the playoffs so technically next episode we could be in the playoffs if we went 2-0 and and then we'd be back to one game per episode and only down to two wheel spins as well for the playoffs we are playing our absolute hearts out this backfield duo is nasty clay russell stepped it up big time today everybody really put in a lot of good work today all right boys hey i love you gentlemen absolute heater once again and i'll see you in the next episode peace